Exclamation, everybody, and welcome back to Wolfenstein The Old Blood. Let's open this door and see what is behind door number one here. Is it is it fabulous prizes or more Nazis to kill? Or both? Oh, dogs. Nazi dogs. That's, that's, that's terrific. I was wondering when they were going to give me dogs that were awake instead of ones that were asleep. Uh, oh, there's some more gold bullion over there. Um, undoubtedly to make me come in here. I wonder, can I do a, can I do a quick save? Uh, is it F5? No. Is it uh, F6? No. <laughs> I don't think, I don't think I have the ability to do quick saves. Uh, but I would actually kind of like to do one. Hang on a second. Never mind, I forgot that we're talking about a game that was designed for consoles where you're not allowed to save whenever you want to. So that's a thing. I, I, I've gotten so used to having games with quick save and stuff on them that I forget that we're, we're back into in the past again. So we got a guy over there. I can push this apparently. Which seems a little bit dangerous. If I'm to be honest. It's just all the way down here, I guess. And so I can walk through here, maybe. Alright. Oh, there's a dog right there. Let's let's see if we can sneak up on this on this dog and Ooh. This guy walking around too. Alright. And he's walking back that way. We'll take care of this dog right now. Excellent. I'll eat his food too, because that's the ultimate in <laughs> the ultimate in uh, investing them. All right. So I guess we'll push this down a little bit further. Yeah. And I guess we can go through that little corridor over there. I'm guessing that's where it wants me to go. Right over here. Uh-huh. There we go. Bypass all that. I don't know why I'm bypassing all that. I mean, it's just more Nazis to kill, but... You know. I, I only have a pipe. I only have a metal pipe right now. So I'm just trying to... There's some... I, some armor I don't actually need, so I, I guess I can put off doing that. Alright, so we got a fence there, to, or a gate there to go through, which I think I can just go this way. Right. Go around it that way. Anything down there doesn't... It looks like the door I'm supposed to go through, but I'd like to just kind of take a quick peek here. Let's see if there's some kind of hidden stuff over here. Hidden stuff! Any hidden stuff? Nope, guess not. Alright, so I guess we'll come back through here. I think that guy has turned around now. Yep, indeed he has. Let's do this. And... Goblamo. Alright. Man, we get through those doors fast, don't we? <laughs> get through them before they close and electrify. Right, that guy is already down for the count, it looks like. So we shall do this. Just to be certain. And we'll take his gun. And now we'll walk very, very slowly. Oh, there's some crates over here. I must I must see what's in the crates. Just for my own edification. I'll take that even though I don't really need it right now. I'm never coming back here anyway, so why <laughs> why not? Why not eat all the things I can eat? Alright, is he gonna end up he's probably gonna end up dropping this again when I when I go and do this, right? 
Map updated. Uh, oh, crap. Do I have to go somewhere to turn the power on? I don't know. It still says right here. Alright, so... There's no power here? Is that... Oh, I, I see. Never mind. Well, it's a good thing I took that guy out before I turned the power back on. That was a good move on my part, I would say. Excellent. And we're going down. All right. Are we are we heading towards housewares? I could uh, use some some more doilies for my for my tabletop. All right. And we got more of these guys. A couple more of them. They're going to die as soon as possible. Oh, damn. <laughs> really? Always run out at the worst possible time. Grab this here. Thank you. Take that, and then you shall take this to the face. There we go. Some more armor, thanks. And yeah, man, they're going through my armor like, like it's nothing. Like it's nothing. Okay. Uh, ooh. Oh, there was a place I could have crawled through. Well, <laughs> well, I guess I took. I, I guess I did that the hard way. <laughs> I can still crawl through there, I suppose. Let's see what's in these boxes first. Anything good? Yeah. And don't look like there's anything in there. All right. That crate was crate was a dud. Giving me dud crates now. I guess I'll take all this am or armor over here now, since <laughs> since I kind of don't need that little passageway. Yeah, I guess I'll take that too because it's got more ammo. Uh, all right, nothing else here. Is there anything in here, like any kind of secrets or anything that I should know about? Like, well, that's armor, but I, I've got I've got plenty of plenty of armor right now. Uh, anything over this one? Just want to make sure I don't leave anything behind. No. Loot. Anyone? Loot. All right. That's fine. That's fine. I get it. You don't like me anymore, loot. Oh, I, I picked up this gun just to lose it again, really? Can I, can I bypass this door going this way? No. <laughs> of course not. Of course not. The game decides what weapons you shall have for the next section. You shall always start back at zero. The game designers demand it. Well, all right. I thought that was something there. I thought, thought there was a guy standing there. Like, well, this is gonna be this is gonna be terrible. Uh, okay. Oh, this Rudy Yager. He's gonna go kill some people. Oh well, I can't do anything for them. I'm sure it won't let me go in there. I'm sure that's just a cutscene to let me know the, the horrors that are going on around me. And this. And this. This is very clumsy. I have to say. Very, very clumsy way of doing things. Uh, okay. So. That's a thing. Let's come on through. Are we going to get another lovely view of his dog's eating eating all the prisoners well that's where we came from ah yes and here's where we're going more dogs hmm hmm I don't really want to go mano a mano with that dog I really don't <laughs> I assume I can take them down I can do takedowns on them alright well I guess I'm going to have to Game sort of like forcing you, like, hey, you know what? You're going to face dogs now because we said so. Or we're going to come over here. Which I can't get through, of course. Of course. Right, let's see if I can... 
There's nothing else around here. Let's go ahead and get in there. Let's just see if I can take one of these dogs out without it knowing about it. Like so. There we go. And... Okay, this other dog is kind of on a weird patrol. There we go. Come on, really fast there. Really fast, BJ. Work with me here, babe. There we go. Alright. So we took them out. We got a bunch of places to climb into here. Alright, what does this get me? Anything of interest? Hmm. Gets me down there. What about on the other side? Is there anything over here? Since I've taken the dogs out, I might as well... <laughs> I've taken the dogs out for pee. <laughs> I might as well see what is over here. Ooh. Yes, let's, let's pry this open. Does this get me anything interesting? Uh, it probably takes me to the same place. Was there a way to get through here? Nah, I guess not. I guess that was just a tease, huh? Alright, well. Geronimo. Man, BJ. You really gotta stick that landing more, babe. <laughs> you're, you're not doing so hot there on, on your landings. Oh, gold. More gold. So we run on down here. Wartung, what, what, Wartung's tunnel, Wartung's tunnel. I guess that means sewer tunnel, possibly, or water, maybe water, water tunnel. No, oh, it's kind of dirty for water to go through there. <laughs> uh, ooh, yeah, they got like a underground lake here. It looks like that they're pumping their water out of. All right. Um, so which way do I go? Do I go this way? I want to go this way for a second and see if there's some shinies here for me, since this was the other way that you could drop down. Right? Right there was the other way. And anything over here? It's another way you could come down. There's a ladder right there. Yes, yeah, a broken ladder. So that's interesting. So obviously that's the way I'm supposed to go. But, uh, was this the, hmm. so I came out this way, maybe? I'm not sure which way I came out now. <laughs> I might be going around in circles at the moment. Nope, nope, this is the, this is the way. This is something different. Alright, the game just saved. That's not a good, that's not a good, <laughs> that's not a good sign at all. Come on over here. Anybody? Alright, well this... I'll tell you one thing though. Very beautiful game. Lots of, uh... Use pipes to destroy unstable walls, okay. A lot of, uh... Nice, uh, you know, architecture work and stuff here. That, that, that brick. That brick is just going to defy physics. That brick says, physics! I laugh at their, in their faces. <laughs> Uh, Alright, and now we gotta climb this wall. And here we go. One hand over the other. Or in my case, one finger over the other. Excellent. Anything over there I should know about? Nope. Alright. Ah, oh, there's Rudy and his, and his dogs. Is that Rudy? Uh, yeah, Rudy. Or whatever. Whatever his name was. What the hell his name was. Uh, okay, we can't go that way, so we gotta go this way. Keep on walking. We're taking the uh, we're taking the scenic route here, getting a getting a nice a nice tour of of the underground of Castle Wolfenstein. Another convenient wall to climb.
Okay. Dog over there. So come in here. Look around. See anything just yet? I do hear some some awfulness. So we'll just kind of sit here for a moment. And then over here we shall go. And just to make sure we don't get seen by this guy moving around. Where the hell is he at? He must be up on the second floor, maybe? Yeah, he must be up on the second floor up there. Let's go take this while we can. And we'll come back through here again. Yeah, he's definitely up there. Alright, so there's a... Dog over there. That one's taken out. This one's taken out. And this guy's coming back this way. Yeah, they purposely put him up there, so it... I have to be quick about this. I suspect... I may, well, there is a place to hide there, so I might be able to take that dog out. Wait until this guy walks back the other way a little bit. It sounds like he's over there now. And a little of this. And then we go hide back in here. Excellent. Making some progress. We are stealthy, stealthy Blaskowitz. Ooh, what the hell? <laughs> wow, I he just jumped right on that ladder. Soon we will be ba badass Blaskowitz again, but right now we are we are ninja Blaskowitz. Alright, that would be good to turn off. I suspect, although this guy's coming back. Let's wait until he does his little patrol here. And we'll do this. Shut that bastard down. For as long as we can and get over here as fast as we can. Take him out. Come on, hurry, hurry, hurry. There we go. Nice. And take his gun. Alright. Yes, we are Ninja Blaskowitz. You've heard of my brother, badass. <laughs> uh, Alright. Is that is that all? <laughs> he says as he's already died several times. Oh, I like I like how you just walk right over top of them. <laughs> Instead of walking through them. As often is the case in these games. Alright, let's uh anything in here I care about? Let's oop, there was some more, I think. Wasn't there? Or was that just a it was an aftershock, I think. Uh and then there, alright. Alright, let's see. Get some concept art unlocked. Alright, we gotta get up in there, it looks like. So Gotta get rid of our awesome gun again. Alright, we are getting a hell of a lot of use out of this pipe, let me tell you. <laughs> this is a this is a multi-purpose pipe right now. Okay. Is this gonna give out from below us or something? No, okay. It's just a just a means to let me know I'm going forward, I suppose. Uh, last time we did this, we ended up with Nazis right at, right in our in our face. Well, here we here we go. Let's do it. Ow! Damn it, BJ! Stick those landings. Roll, roll when you hit the ground. <laughs> okay, is there anything over here besides really nasty toilets? 
Hello. Oh, there's a prisoner there. someone else all right sanitarium patient uh no thank you I, I thought for a moment there he was gonna like eat my fingers or something i was like yeah this not not a good not a good idea <laughs> not a good idea to piss it off blaskowitz article medieval sword unearthed in wolfberg berlin november 3rd 1945 Archaeologists have unearthed fragments of a sword buried underneath a street in Wolfburg. The sword has been dated to the 10th century and belonged to a medieval knight. The archaeologist leading the dig, Lati Cole, commented today on the find with enthusiasm. The knight was in the service of King Otto, the Holy Roman Emperor, when he was, for unknown reasons, killed on the streets of Wolfburg. It is unclear how this find relates to the raising of Wolfburg, which took place in 965 AD, but it strengthens the most popular theory among local historians that a group of knights sent out by King Otto were killed when they were trying to defend the city from invading bandits. Um, okay, so that's... Okay, you, you, need to, you need to shush. You need to shush, because I'm trying to, trying to sneak around here, guy. Just, just shush. <laughs> uh, oh, there we go. Pick that one up. Run forward plus left shift and C to sprint. Oh, boy. Left shift and C to sprint slide. Okay. Let's see if I can do this. Yeah, right. Uh, let's try that again. There we go. I'll tell you about Aunt Sarah. Diagnosed with dementia during college. Medication made her drowsy and strange. I remember those eyes of hers, like dirty windows on some derelict shack. Grandma told me it passed through the blood. Well, now we've done it. <laughs> and next time, we will try to get ourselves out of the sanitarium with some measure of sanity left in us. Thanks so much for watching, everybody, and I will see you next time.